Aloha. Thanks for your consideration of the views expressed in this think tech commentary, which we are calling over the cliff. With the coming election, the country is at a serious inflection point, and it's hard to imagine a soft landing. Some people say we are about to go over a cliff. Is that true? If so, what will happen to us, and what will happen to the country? What can we do to deal with the risks involved? This commentary takes a look. As someone who participates in a variety of talk shows on American issues and America's place in the world, I have great concern about our future. I am concerned about the threats that Donald Trump has made. I am concerned about how his followers will act on those threats. I am concerned that our lives and liberties will not be the same, and that we will lose the rights and benefits we have had, and the protections of our constitution, our rule of law and our democracy. I am concerned that we will wind up living under the kind of oppressive dictatorships we saw in Europe. We all need to be aware of these risks, and we all need to think of how we can avoid them. At this point, let's examine some fundamental strategies that you should consider. 1. Recognizing the realities. We need to stay well informed about what is going on in this country and in the world, no matter how troubling those things may be. 2. Making a rational analysis. We need to analyze how these risks may affect us and our families, businesses, and friends. We must remain rational no matter how threatening things may be. 3. Getting your head straight. The most important thing is that we cannot be complacent. But at the same time, we must avoid fear and panic about what might happen. 4. Organizing an effective plan. We must spend the time to make and develop a plan that will help us deal with possible risks and threats, and to revise that plan as things evolve. In the years to come, when your children and grandchildren ask you what you did to protect our democracy, what will you tell them? Now's the time to take those steps and think of a good answer. You do want to be able to say that you recognized the realities, that you remained rational, that you kept your head straight, and that you made an effective plan that minimized the risks and threats to you and to your business, your family and friends, and to your community. It may not be easy. And may involve some real sacrifices, contentions and dislocations, so you must be prepared for that and give it your best shot, and you must be watchful and creative as things go forward. The stakes are as high as they can be, so you have to be deadly serious about making the commitment and standing up for what you feel is right. Okay, that's it for this commentary, but there's so much more in our huge collection of think tech commentaries and in our legacy collection of think tech talk shows. You can check them out on thinktechhawaii.com and youtube.com slash thinktechhawaii. Thanks for watching, and thanks for your consideration of the views expressed in this think tech commentary. We'll see you again soon for the next one. Aloha.